continuing with the last video uh, we have seen the unboxing of the video of the device so now just to you to show you the overview like what are the interfaces are available so if you go to the right side we have the power button we have the volume button and on the left side we have the audio jack 3.5 mm audio jack and here you have the slots for sim cards and usb otc usb otc and for the sim card so this supports 3g and uh, usb otc and this is a 2 megapixel camera this can be used for qr code scanning and for photos and this is having one uh, 5200 mAh battery okay so coming to the uh, pay and parking application we will have a brief demo about the application how we can use and uh, what will be the benefits of using this app we will be discussing in this video so first of all when you open the first uh, home screen this will look like this after installation so this will not have anything actually so here uh, you will be having different operators you can select which shift ok so after uh, you, if you go to the operator here no operator found so what we have to do is first we have to do the setup so how to do the setup go to the side panel and yeah, add operators so add operator some xyz i saved it so this is saved in the operator list so next we come back if you want to add one more or two three more uh, we can add we can add unlimited number of operators as we want so uh, then we have to set the pricing so pricing we have categorized for two wheeler three wheeler four wheeler and track or van so we can give different different prices for different different ranges so for example i'll give 10 rupees for two wheeler uh, 12 rupees for uh, four wheeler three wheeler and four uh, four wheeler i'll give some 15 rupees so before that uh, before uh, giving all the prices we have to just uh, click on update and save price update save update save and for track and all we will give 20 so this is actually power per hour charges ok so coming to the next so where here we get the reports as well so this will, will come later on so now let us go to home and we will see here we can see the uh, added uh, operators so for just for example we will see you select abc and he has uh, first shift today so first shift and proceed so he will be having the device and so uh, for example one bike came we can add the bike number ka 01 f2012 just for example i have given one number and parking in so after giving the parking we will get the receipt like this so i have just made it for a sample so we will get the qr code vehicle number arrival time all those things all those details we will get it so who is operator has them and we will get some display and after, now after finishing uh, all the like his uh, stops he can come back and he will claim the uh, he will show the receipt to the operator there so operators will select the exit and he will keep the car number so here we have two options actually even he can scan the qr code he mentioned here or else he can enter the uh, number so the number we have entered is ka01 f 2012 so if we go to facts so we'll see that he has entered this uh, 56 and uh, exit time is 30 uh, sorry entry time is 35 minutes 35 and we are exiting at 36 so his charge total amount is 10 so what you can do just we can print it so now the printout will come with, with the bills so 10 rupees is the charge and what time he has entered and departure all those things will be given so one more thing just i'll show the uh, if we want to uh, print it or if you want to see the reports that okay how many people entered today so for that we have made, made the report color so we can just go to report day wise so we can choose like uh, any number of dates like from any any date we can choose from that uh, span how many cars came or uh, so i'll select today's date so we'll generate so i you can see that i can have uh, 
uh, one and third today and I have collected 10 rupees so it will be added almost all the time so how much ever, how, how much ever it is coming it will be added one by one so after this we can export this report to our SD card so just click on uh, export report and this report is generated and uh, exported to SD card so I'll just show you how we can see the SD card reports So it will be most probably on downloads. So I can see 06 18 7. So this is the total today's date. Even you can uh, take it to your computer and uh, you can paste it on Excel. So that will be a, a good option. Yeah, it is loaded and it, as you can see, like uh, I have opened my Excel sheet. So here the serial numbers, whatever previously I had and uh, still parking or not parking or, or uh, what is the bill number and what is the uh, car number, okay, and what was the bill amount. So everything will be listed on the uh, Excel sheet which you can uh, uh, use it for a report and you can paste it on your Excel sheet as a appending, appending the Excel sheet. So uh, and one more thing we can clear the report as well if we go to go to the app and here on the left panel we can see the reports as a day wise. So just click on whatever day you want to select. So 7 and choose some date like today's date only let me select and generate so you can see that today's uh, vehicle park is one vehicle park so this report we can uh, delete as well so how can we do that day shift so i'll select some date today's date and clear records so delete it will ask for confirmation records deleted so if you go to generate now there is no car bank part no no revenue nothing it is zero so always be careful before deleting that you back up your data so that's all about this parking application thank you